Okay, let's start our video tour of this uh, 1986 Carver 28 Riviera aft cabin cruiser. Very unique and neat laid out boat. Very, very good condition. Virtually everything on this boat has been replaced and is new. Canvas is all new. New electronics, including radar. New anchors, new upholstery. Just about everything you can think of on this boat has been redone. It's a freshwater boat, just came down in the last year from the Great Lakes via Maine. So the engines have been in fresh water all of their lives, basically. The uh, hour log shows 700 hours. I don't know if that's accurate. The owner thinks more, maybe closer to 17, which would be consistent with the age of the boat. around the manifold, the risers, really, really good condition. But if you're looking for a, basically a new boat, this would be certainly a candidate because despite its age, and don't let that, be, that fool you, this boat's in wonderful condition forward uh, cabin top here just so we can get a panoramic view of the uh, bow area of the boat. Looking forward you've got a bow sprit with a, uh, an anchor, spare anchor here, two anchors, two anchor lockers. Very, very clean. A nice hatch in the forward cabin area. New horns, windshield wipers, new canvas, new radar slash GPS. So as you can see this boat has been ba basically uh, re rebuilt. Not rebuilt, maybe that's not the right word, re-equipped. Very up-to-date and modern equipment coming down the starboard side deck now. A little bit of dirt which the owner is going to have cleaned up. He's very, very meticulous and uh, really wants this boat to shine in the best way possible. It's completely covered in. It's removable top cover. As you can see, the Simrad is new. Got a speaker, horn, searchlight. TV connection, everything you could possibly want. Going to the after part of the boat now. You can see that it has a uh, nice lit stairway down. Everything looks in tip top shape. All of the uh, new cushions, upholstery curtains, the owner keep at home so they don't get affected by moisture. So uh, they have individual pictures in the listing of all that stuff. But once again, everything is really, really new and nice on this boat. Okay, I'm standing just beside the captain's and passenger's chairs here, so um, kind of mid-cockpit. So I'm showing the uh, forward part of the cockpit area. Going to starboard, captain's seat. Upholstery looks really good. Control area, Simrad radar slash GPS units, everything's electronic. Control panel looks really good. Seller says everything works on this boat. You've got an Icon VHF. The VHF part is actually down, mounted down below, and this is a kind of a handheld part of it. You've got an autopilot down here. This boat's got everything on it. A really nice passenger passenger area. And the seat goes back and forth. So, segue into the after part of the main cabin here. There's a uh, vignette table. There's a cushion that goes over that back box, in case you're wondering. Uh, table needs to be refinished. Wood needs to be redone. Some maybe new Formica put on. Got a stereo system down below. Entryways, fire extinguisher, main battery switch down here. Lots of storage spaces on this boat. Everything is uh, all this new line, 
a lot of new stuff on this boat just about everything I would say has been replaced or updated so this is ter terrifically great condition for it. its age in fact I wouldn't even discount age as any factor on all this assuming the hull is okay it's been a freshwater boat as I mentioned and uh, shows very little wear and tear as you can see from the engine pictures in the listing now aft cabin going back here uh, I will do that in another clip. Okay, let's start our video tour of the front cabin of this 28-foot uh, carver. Going down the companionway here. Okay, forward is a uh, V-berth arrangement. Upholstery is all new and clean. Everything is clean. No signs of any water intrusion or anything like that in the overheads or the windows. So up forward, you've got Quite a large seating area with a dinette table under here. You've got your battery charger. There is a portable air conditioner. And in here you've got your stereo system. On the starboard side is a storage locker and your control panel. Coming back to the galley area now, you've got a nice compact little galley, but that's very, very functional, even if you lived aboard. You've got a uh, Princess three burner electric stove. Look at that, it's really never even been used. And it's the original. Very, very clean oven once again. You've got a uh, microwave and a new fridge, nor cold. <clears throat> Once again, everything on this boat is spick and span. Uh, just needs a few finishing touches and you've got yourself a gem. Now it's got a fully enclosed head with electric toilet, shower. All of the plumbing is brand new, the toilet's brand new, everything like that, sink. All the plumbing has been done. Got a macerator and all of that kind of good stuff. So a very, very livable, very, very functional arrangement down forward. This table lifts up and out and folds down for another berth. Down here, of course, you've got your bilge pumps and all that kind of good stuff. And the air conditioner, I believe I mentioned, is a portable unit, so should be good for most purposes. The engine uh, engines are under these three hatches, and in order to get at the uh, side engines, you kind of have to move all of this stuff out of the way, which we don't have time for today. Once again, coming back into the main area. Very nice boat. <laughs> hey, looking at the aft cabin here, I'm just going to turn around. On the port side, you have a six foot or so double bunk. Lots of windows, lots of bright spaces. Nice big wide door. And on the starboard side, you have a somewhat shorter bunk. I'd say it's about five foot five. Batteries are down here under this box, under the step. One, two, three, big interstates. And then underneath the uh, bunk here, you've got your hot water heater and all that. All of the cushions and everything, as I mentioned before, are stored at the owner's home. There's tons of room on this boat. Look at the plumbing, all brand new and been replaced. Everything is really up to snuff on this boat completely. Okay, let's go back up to the main cockpit now. 